Hello, I'm Richard Murphy, and I want to do another introductory video to the themes that we're going to look at in my YouTube channel. And this time I want to talk about accountancy. Now, please stay online. This is really important. Accountancy has a reputation for being dull, but I promise you it isn't. Accountancy is how we look at the world of business. And business is really important. I believe very strongly in that point. We have to have strong businesses to create employment in our communities. But we also have to have businesses that we can understand because we are dependent upon them. Anyone with a private pension should know that. Everybody's private pensions are invested, at least in part, in the business community. So understanding how business works is vital. And how we understand that business works is through its accounting literally what it tells us about itself. But there aren't actually any fixed rules of accounting, although if you ask most accountants, they'll say the rule book is enormous. And it's true, it is, it's vast, but it's capable of change to suit the needs of society. And there's a really big problem in accountancy right now, which is what I'm really going to explore in this video series. Because accountancy assumes that the only people who are interested in business are the investors in the world's large companies. But of course that's not true. There are small businesses where the shareholders, the directors, the managers have very different accounting needs from those people who read the accounts of large companies. In the case of large companies, there's large amounts of information that information designed for investors does not meet. So, for example, employees want to know about where their company employs staff. By country, maybe. They might want to know what the different pay rates on average are between countries. Or other people, for example, people who are concerned about climate might want to know where the company is operating with regard to its activities particularly if they're in something like the extractive industries, oil or gas or timber, to make sure they know where the product supply chain is. People are concerned about tax payments, and we're all concerned about tax payments, and business tax has been a big theme of the news for the last decade or so. Well, we need to know whether a business is paying tax and where and why, but the accounts that we get aren't really very good at answering that question. And in the long term, there's another big issue. Can businesses survive the process of transformation that climate change is going to impose upon them? As we're recording this video, we're hearing about oil companies around the world making billions of pounds worth of losses as they record the fact that their oil assets are not worth the price that they thought. That has a direct impact on your pension. About eight pounds in every 100 pounds of dividends received by UK pension funds comes from one company and that's British Petroleum, BP. So if these companies get their assumptions wrong, it hurts. So accounting matters, and how accounting should change to meet our needs as society changes, as we realize we've got to live in a different way, is the theme that we're going to address. So if you're interested, click the subscribe button below, ask questions below, follow me on Twitter, at Richard J. Murphy, look at my blog, Tax Research UK. Ask questions, we'll try to answer them. Accountancy is fun. Trust me, I'm a chartered accountant. Thank you.